Uh, good afternoon, dear colleagues. Uh, today I would like to talk about surgical oncology training expectation, success and uh, disappointment. Nowadays, modern surgery is a difficult specialty that includes both science and arts. It is false uh, the expenses, I'm sorry. Um, the surgery is just uh, handmade th uh, thing because the operations is uh, preceded by the preoperative investigation of the patient planning of the operation course and so uh, many things. Uh, I would start so words of greatest Russian oncology surgery, Mikhail Davidov, they talk that uh, surgery is the medicine of young uh, gener uh, generation. Is this true? We will still be young when we will come to the checkpoint name and realization of the, your surgical dreams in oncology. Um, let's see what happens with the young students after the university. Of course, they enter the clinic uh, department. Uh, they feel uh, very big stress. Uh, in our country, it is uh, possible two types of uh, surgical way in oncology. If you want uh, to the fast track, you can go to directly to the residency of the clinical oncology. Uh, or you can uh, choose long way uh, that uh, consisted of residency of general surgery. And uh, another one step, uh, you can go to the uh, residency in clinical oncology. Um, Mm. What about uh, general surgery way? Unfortunately, in Russia, there is no certain rules and prescription for this type of residency. Maybe the next year something will change, but now it's a very difficult equation. In my opinion, it's very necessary, uh, necessary surgical basis that should be obtained by every young doctor which would like to spend, uh, to spend uh, his future in the surgical oncology. During this time, young doctor should master a, com uh, a competent engagement with patient. Currently, competition of medical documentation and uh, understanding what the preoperative and postoperative uh, period for patient needs. Surgical parts include first, it's uh, assistant, then making steps on the operation, and finally, as a result, independent, uh, independent surgical activity, uh, activity under the close monitoring of the mentor. I'm sorry. Uh, for uh, two years, uh, the surgical oncology gains a body of knowledge that extends to all uh, factors of cancer, including uh, prevention, diagnosis, treatment, rehabilitation, and observation. Uh, what expertise uh, do we have when we come to the NM residence? We think that somebody will uh, show us the clinical process. Somebody will educate us. And of course, in case of any trouble, somebody will help us. What about reality? In fact, initially, a lot of paperwork comes failing down, uh, down at you. And it doesn't matter if you understand it or not. You must show the results. With this paperwork, uh, automatically come a necessary task. And residents automatically becomes a, a secretary. To all of this uh, is added absence of explanation and competition. And competition not only between the residents. Sometimes when a doctor see a talent resident, a competition appears between them. What about an uh, interpersonal relationship? Both parts of this process should uh, stimulate each other. For example, when residents come to the station, doctor should not neglect him. It happens, the resident interest disappears. It's the same thing happens uh, with the doctor. It's the absorbers, absolent um, indifference of the student. He doesn't want to teach him more. And it would present a comparative picture of surgical development in oncology uh, on the example of life, my and my 
friend Alexander from the uh, center of a clinical uh, hospital visible, this thing for future in education we have not received. It was a basis medical university, a residency of oncology, of uh, thoracal surgery, refreshing course of endoscopic surgery. But different results we take in general surgery uh, and uh, in other of steps of, of our education, it's uh, different, uh, different results of surgery in oncology. Uh, sometimes when you are very close towards the goal, some of your older colleagues may be not sure in your possibilities. And in such a situation, they just have take uh, away every change of the residence. Even such simple like uh, maybe skin suture, it may happen because of two things. It's insurance or fear of uh, competition. Uh, your surgical activity depends on fundamental knowledge, manual skin, personal quietness, the region and rating of the education center, interest in the learning, if you talk about mentor, basic uh, combining both emergency and planning surgery. Uh, the surgery is not only operation room, I think it's a very big, big job in outside of it. Uh, you may be training endoscopic and uh, simulation uh, stains, uh, cadaver courses, practical in the skills of the vascular, uh, vascular uh, suture, and so many more. Uh, all surgical oncologists have an education responsibility and teaching role that should benefit their surgical colleagues through continuing education. Uh, some conclusion founded during the uh, preparation of this report. Uh, I think uh, if you want to practice surgical oncology in thoracic abdominal, uh, abdominal, abdominal localization and maybe another sub specialties, uh, the general surgery uh, must have in your life. But now we um, have not rules, we have not standards of surgical education, we have not professional lift of development, we have not aims of creating training programs, and we have absence of collaboration with foreign colleagues and obligatory surgical trainings abroad. I allowed myself to change the words of the great Greek philosopher and um, finally I want to say that the residents, it's not the vessels that needs to be filled, but the tours that needs to be lit. Thank you for your attention.